Hello and welcome to another episode of How to Lose at the Last of Us. I'm the loser, Jeff, and I'll be losing at the last of us today. Oh shit, rats. Come and nibble on my booty. Mm, nibble, go ahead. Not a biter. Not one. Last episode of How to Lose at the Last of Us started in the exact same spot. But let me tell you, noble viewer, loyal viewer, it won't end in the same spot. That's right. That's right. This video is going places. And you're gonna go along with it. At least I will. Um... How do I put this? I'm starting to hate the infected. Before, it was scientific curiosity that kept me focused on their fungal ways. Now, it's a deep-seated hatred for their supposed way of life. They're not plants. They're not animalia. This is the realm of the mycologist. And I don't like it one bit. Stay down. These folks have taken the fun out of fungus. Their dour ways have infected me, dear viewer. And to keep things safe, don't let them have that little loop. They can get you. You only have one bullet left in this here revolver. There they go. Yes. Yes, this is your territory. Yes. They are about to die, aren't they, Joel? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Alright. And finally... Where's... Oh, there you are. Yeah. Dim with it, bastard. No! 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 What? It turns out it was the will to live that Joel needed to survive. The will to live that had long escaped him. Yeah, I'm gonna make it. I mean, come on. Who gives a shit? Use it. Uh, my arm, my arm hurts. Oh, I bet it feels better now, doesn't it, Joel? Let's find that key card. It's over here. Let's not even bother to look at the noise coming from our left. Let's grab the key card. Let's grab the brick. Wait a tick. Stop and listen to the noises down the hall. Short fall. Okay. Come on. Time to generate some power. You know, I've been complaining, and yes. I'm well aware of that. The fact is, are you? <laughs> Whoa! Hey, man. I was pressing R2. Come on, man. Come on! No! There's always a post-mortem for every jewel that has come through these drowned halls of post-apocalyptica. 
Anyway, um... Shit. What I'm trying to say... I... Postmortem would be, uh... Analyzing the cause of death. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about a moment of silence, basically. A, uh... A brief... Second of respect for the Joel that was. Man, this is a tough section, y'all. So I'm gonna pull the generator. Last time I decided to go through this way. There was one... Oh, I went through this hall, by the way. To that staircase. Maybe this is better, I don't know. Anyway, there was one infected here. The bloated was up there somewhere. I found another infected here, then there were two right here. Um, all in all, not a great path. It's certainly not the path of least resistance, but there's, it's, it's dead, I mean, like, it doesn't appear like there's a, a way to go around this, you know? Wiggle. There we go. There they are. Anyway, I was saying before that I've been complaining. It's just for fun. In fact, this whole venture, it's all for fun. Does that blow your mind? Of course not. I'm saying that I actually enjoy the trial and error process and the eventual, like, mastery section, ideally. He says, well, taking two hits after missing a close range shot. Um, you know, when you first try a section and then you fail like a fool, and eventually you're like, you know exactly that there's four infected or something, or that they will, they like to pretend to sneak up on you, or that. Like, that's why I did a little spin move. I thought if I showed my butt, she'd come looking for me. Oh, and they're running this way. Okay, and you're running this way. That's not fair. That's two different directions. Oh, they're eating me. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah. So much for the dream of mastery. Instead, I'm left with the waking nightmare of failure. Oh, shit. But we continue. We grab the cloth. We grab the duct tape. We avoid every urge to sing about duct tales or sing the duct tales melody with duct tape as the placeholder words for those two titular words. We walk along this lonely path. We ignore every sound we hear because they only come out once you either pick up the key card or you jiggle the handle. There's two ways about it, y'all. Ready when you are, chum. Hello. Come on. No. <laughs> you stopped. Hmm. I saw you. Well, it's okay. I don't. Are you coming for me? No. Are you coming for me? Yes. If you haven't... Oh, shit. That's my bad. Changing weapons. Like an amateur. Man. I'm starting to think this grounded mode is hard. Eh, 
anyway. I'm changing the, uh, I'm trying to preserve shotgun shells. Obviously, it's much easier to use those on, in this situation, which would lead someone to think, well, why don't you use them, you dinglebat? First off, dinglebat, what the fuck is that? Second, shotgun shells are going to get me through part two of this hellscape. That's the dream, at least. Um. Yeah. So, this part. I just don't know. Wood don't work? What the fuck? You'd think by now somebody would have come to fix this door. Alright. So, here's a pro tip from the loser chef. That's me. Don't miss. Don't miss twice in a row either. And don't forget to load your shotgun up. Also, don't start listing pro tips seconds before you die. Uh. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. Oh, shit. Grabbing the claw. Walking over rats. Thinking about that one time they didn't want to bite my butt. Thinking about that one time I saw them go under there, like, as if they knew that they could just flow through that channel. They walked through the walls, y'all, and it was strange to behold. I missed the scrap like an amateur. Like a fool. Them five scrap could mean the difference between life and death, damn life. Yes, sir. Alright. Here we go. Woo! Alright. And then we got the one. We got the two. We got the three. We got the four. Is it shotgun time? Is it time I give up on my dream of preserving shotgun ammo? Man, today it is. No? You're not coming for me? There you are. Okay, fine. 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 Thanks for just stopping, by the way. I don't know why you did that, but I appreciate it. Okay, I'm gonna die. Alright. Here comes the shotgun run. Alright, folks. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing. It's shotguns only. Rats flow. Candy bars don't exist. Duct tape is near. The ramp beckons. Somewhere in a cupboard Scrap sleeps. The burly, hairy Texan takes all five pieces. Shotguns only. Alright, if this doesn't work, I will try the key card for the ten attempts that I tried door handle. Shotguns only. Shotguns only. 
I thought for sure they would be in that tiny section. There you are. There's another one. Shot comes only. I don't like leaving that little ramp behind me, but I think I'll hear them if they decide to come. I certainly don't like going through that door. There's one. I mean... There you go. Oh, I hear you. You dick. Thank you for missing. Apparently I wasted all my shotgun ammo. Did I fire just there? I mean, signs pointed yes. Oh, my flashlight was off. Man, I must have, like, gripped my controller. There you are. Don't miss. Okay. How are you breathing? How you can't make those sounds if your mouth is underwater, you crazy fella. Yeah, if you play this game for nine thousand hours, you're gonna get you're gonna notice some inconsistencies of the world's reality and the game's reality. Okay. Before you start, we're, we, we're using all of our resources, okay? I mean, consider this. If When else could they be more useful than this exact moment? Okay. Yep. Bro. Oh my god! Damn it. All the zombies be screaming about the new generation. Hello. Oh, thank you for missing. Alright, so I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. And then I got. Hello. Oh, I'm gonna beat you to death. That's what the shotgun shell avoids, you know? If I could save every shell, I could get through this hell. Oh, shit. Monday, Monday. Duct tape in the store shed. There's a lob that in the land of the dead. Scrappy cumbered. Become uncovered. I open the door. I get some more. Now I'm walking down the hall. I don't want to fall through this empty doorway. Broken handle. Coming for ya. Also reloading. Gonna preserve a shotgun shell. What the fuck? What the fuck? Hmm. Hmm. This is... this is how. They remind me who I really am. Oh, shit. See? Ghost rats. Proof that Joel has gone insane! Or something. What a 
I have to be rich. You all know I'm afraid of rats. Yep. What? What do you mean I forgot to reload my shotgun? What do you mean I shouldn't be running towards the danger while reloading my shotgun? What do you mean I... I'm lost for words, scrambling to make meaning in this post-shotgun world that we're living in. Oh, that would've been cool. It sounded like I hit, but I'm certain I didn't. Oh, I thought I saw something. Hi! Two shotting somebody seems like an enormous waste with a shotgun, frankly. Hmm, what's the best way to handle this? That, I guess. Hey! I thought I got all four. Apparently you're the... What? Oh... No! No, 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 no. Okay. I... Did I... I did grab that other arrow. Okay. Um... There's a broken one. There's a bloated corpse. And there's that one that I fired willy-nilly. Willy-nilly! This Molotov will help us get through the... the hell. I just gulped, like in the cartoons. Alright. Hey! God damn it. Joel, it's okay to be afraid. Damn it. But it's not okay to lose. Yeah, I see you. Yeah, oh. Oh. This changes a lot of things, actually. And including that. Oh, nope, nope. Flashlight stays on. Kill it. No! God damn it. Damn. My thought was, if I run into that room, the bloater, he falls down, then I can retreat, basically, and then get a free pass to, uh, I did grab that, right? Yes, I did. Um, free pass to go the other way. Because once he's down there, he's way too slow to catch up. But, there's the other folks to concern yourself with. Yeah, I call them folks. I go between fungal beasts and folks. Also, where in God's name are these bloaters coming from? Well, this one seems like he could become something. But, I mean, Frank, like, there's no rational explanation for this. Uh, ideally, when you jiggle and they spawn, they would, uh, or they would, like, come out of the fungus or something, right? Like, and in that case, you should be able to see them before they spawn and possibly preemptively kill them. Now, doing that would be like a huge waste of resources in the case that they don't actually spawn. 
but anyway, don't worry, Naughty Dog. Let me just try and rebalance your game for you three years after it comes out as an amateur idiot instead of a professional game designer. All right. Jeff Ross, amateur idiot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I don't think I've ever gotten past this section without using the shotgun. It's gonna happen. I gotta use the shotgun every time from here on out, and I don't like it. As the words come out of my, my mouth, I'm filled with remorse and sadness. Go grab the cloth. Grab the duct tape. Oh, so grab the shit you once used to make stuff. That was a voice cracky. Grab it. Yeah, you grabbed it. Yeah, you're a grabber. Not that kind of grabber. Like the good kind. Yeah. Like the kind you use to hold up window washers. Or, uh. What's it called? Like Windex, basically. Apparently, he was right here. I'm not buying it. Anyway. Come for me. Wow! How did he survive an attack from so close? That one exploded. Yeah, no biggie, I'll come to you. Jesus H. Christ. it up, bitches. Then you point at the door. You talk some more. You don't move till somebody comes for you. Anybody out there? Is there anybody out there? There is no pain that you are feeling. Alright. I hear you, but I don't see you. It's like it's your whole thing, your whole shtick. Is there anybody out there? Thank you for only attacking once. Now I can move on with my precious life. Now you, dear viewer, you might be thinking, <clears throat> But Jeffrey, why would you use the Molotov cocktail instead of the Medikit? To thee, I say. If I get hit, 
the medicine ain't gonna help none. Yes, sir. My grammar gun done bad now. No. Look. Friend. Yeah, I told you, friend. There, the bloater fell. Okay. Don't ambush me. Wow. Wow. Now, we're dealing with a combat expert here. <laughs> Did you see those jukes? Okay. Like, in that situation there, I would have died if I had full health or the scrap I had remaining. But... I didn't use the... the Molotov at all. That's the big difference maker. Once... I start running around, I gotta start... I gotta take that Molotov out and I gotta waste it on one guy. And I gotta feel the cringe in my body. I think of all those resources literally going up in smoke. But I have zero choice. I have spent like an hour and 15 minutes at this portion by now. Something like that. Time has no meaning now, as I say frequently. You can ask anyone, and they'd be like, yep. Jeff says that a lot. And I'd be like, yep. Oh, I'm not wiggling this one. I'm trying the credit card now. The credit card, yeah. Uh, yes, I'd like to purchase Escape from Hell, please. Uh, yeah, I'll put it on my card. So, make sure my shotgun's reloaded. It's not reloaded. Read the poster. Hair trigger future tank. Carmack. Oh, I really wanted to shoot that bastard. Come for me. Come for me. I got a shotgun for you. I got a shot for you. Damn. You did. I know another one. There you are, yes. The trick is to aim below their head, because sometimes a shot to the nog will only take out that fungus with the shotgun. Hello! Is there anybody out there? God damn it! The exact same thing! The music didn't stop. There it goes. Is there anybody out there? Alright. And... Uno. Don't. Trace. As in, leave quickly without a trace. Quick, make the bloater fall down here for some reason. There he goes. Quick, run around. Alright. How He hit me through the wall. Now that's... That's unbelievable. I'm clutching that section... The bridge of my nose, that's what they call it. But, yeah. Uh, no. Christ on crutches. Here we go. Ghost rat, where are you going, ghost rat? I'm gonna follow one rat, see where he goes. They all run under here. I think I saw one bounce up under the shelf. I don't know how that happens, but hell, I ain't questioning it in this place that I'm gone hell. Joel, what the fuck happened to you in a past life to make you live through this? Joel, it's your fault that your daughter died. Uh, zip, a zip, zip, Dewey. Maybe, maybe Joel was dead from the beginning. <gasps> Do you feel stunned, viewer? 
trying to add more vile to the way I say the word viewer. It just, it's not vile enough. Alright, here we go. Come on. Hello, I saw you too. Don't worry. I'm coming for you. Jesus. Oh. You earned the right to live. I earned the right to die. That's the sound of a shredding guitar. It's a... It's a... Song by Relentless Slaughter. No, I don't know. Ignore the rats. Shit. Grab the duck t t t t t t t tape. Go for the scramp. It's time to freestyle rap. My name is Rappin' Joel, and I'm here to say it's fun to rap in an apocalypse way. Here in the world, after 2012, things have gone to hell. Fungus, it rides on the wall, just like I ride the flow. And all the people that see me say, Joel, it must be fun to rhyme in a rapping way. Gross. I'm sorry those words came out of my mouth. It's okay, you can come. It's okay. All are welcome at Joel's table of death. I saw you, man. It doesn't count as sneaking if I see you run away. It means that you're afraid of me. And I don't think you are. Come on. Don't. Okay, I've crossed the threshold. Whoa. Oh, who's gonna go first? Okay, I'll go in here, but I'm not gonna like it. Oh, there they come. Oh. All right. All right. Bum, 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 bum. Hello. Um. I was just thinking, like, in some games, if you lose a certain a section long enough, consistently enough, they give you, like, more ammo or bullshit when you die. Oh, there's pills here! There's been pills the whole time. Amazing. There's been pills the whole time. Uh. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. They give you, like, ammo and stuff. Like, oh, suddenly your gun is full of ammo. Or... Oh, you have a different gun in your pocket now. I don't know. That sort of thing. In Mario games, you'll get, like, the pea feather, whatever, the pea wing. I know. Hello. I missed. The game's over. Is there anybody out there? <laughs> oh, God. Anyway, I was just thinking, like, what if... What if there was a little cube that floated above my head? Or a barrel, Donkey Kong style. If it was just like Donkey Kong, I would hit the barrel, and then another version of Joel would come out, except his hair would all be stark white. And... He would, like, go through the level at speeds that wouldn't be humanly possible. Yeah. I don't want to live in that world in which a barrel floats over Joel's dumb nog, but... We're, uh... This is the world we're living in. The one where... It's gotten to the point where I just repeat myself over and over and start to freestyle in horrifyingly awful ways. Come on. 
Come on. Find that key card. We're going to do option B this time. We're using the shotgun. We're going through with the normal shit. This is the part where we just aim out the door because we don't want to get ambushed. If we do, we die. There goes the one that looks just like you. If I stick my head out, I'll be attacked. It's true. If I get too close to the door, it's over. Hello. Hello. Sometimes they wiggle around like, dang, dang, like they got tagged and tagged and they had to lay down or something. I don't know. That's a very specific thing that has probably never happened to anyone. I know the last one is around here somewhere. That was the finest moment I have ever experienced. Thank you, viewer for being able to share this moment with me. Just had to make sure I grabbed those pills. Gotta get those pills! Never even seen that movie. I want that pill. Come on. Yes! Yes! Alright. This is the part where we make the blow to come down here. Then we regret that we didn't make a Molotov. Then we grab the bow. Because it's literally our only choice for gun right now. Then we kill this guy. Ugh. Then we smash square. Then we smash square. Then we accidentally hit the table with our controller a little bit. Then we reluctantly check the time. And then we think about how we've got one last shot. And I'm not giving away my shot. My Lin Manuel Miranda is pitch perfect. Shit. Hopping along the trail of rats. Grabbing the duct tape. I know where it's at. Going up the ramp now. Bottom, bottom. Grabbing all the scrap now. Bottom, bottom. Thinking about another path to take. Sitting in that room, I saved the shotgun. Grabbing all the pills now. Going back to that room with the key card. What's this song supposed to be? I don't know. I don't know, guys. I just don't know anymore. Grab the key card, you reload the shotgun, you look at that guy who literally spawned right there. At least I didn't see him like appear. What? What? We all saw that him just pass through the arrow, right? Like, right? 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 Oh, grabbing the cloth. Grabbing the cloth. Grabbing the cloth. Grabbing the tape. Going up the ramp. Going up the ramp. Grabbing all the scrap. Grabbing all the scrap, reloading the shotgun ahead of time. Reducing all my thoughts into musical rhymes. Grabbing the pills. Grabbing the pills. Heading back to the spot with the key card. 
grabbing my pistol because I'm gonna shoot that one guy that spawns the second I grab this. A little out of way, Max, from there. Ooh, ooh. This is the run, guys. This is it. I believe in America. Grabbing the arrow. Saving my shotgun shells. Oh my god! This is it. This is it. Yes, I believe in uh, America. Okay. Double. Everything's reloaded. Got the bow. I haven't taken any damage. Gonna get the Molotov ready. Remember, it's double tap down. Here's the plan. I go. Oh, shit. I go to the left room, make the bloater fall down. I come all the way back to this room, go up this ramp, take the shotgun out, kill the two that come at me first, then switch to the Molotov. Come at me, bloaty. Then. Uh. The rest of it, I gotta use the bow, I guess. Come at me. Yes. I saw you. Yes. Oh, uh-oh. I know I left that arrow there. It's okay. Do not weep for the arrow. Ah! No! No! You use the key card. Come on, man. No! He's coming for you. Jesus Christ! Joel, no! <laughs> oh my god! Oh. Joel. Joel, you spawned in a different location. Oh. Oh, that alarm sound means it's time to end the episode. Oh. I feel so vindicated. Jeez. Yes. Yes. Thank you for watching How to Lose at the Last of Us. Please subscribe to watch me lose more. And you're gonna see a couple of wins, baby. If you stick around long enough, we made her. God, yes, we made her. All right, thanks for your time, and I will see you on the next time.